Tie just kind of a simple March Brown. I've got a size 14 hook in the vise with 20 thousandths lead wire. I'm going to start my thread dam on the back side. I don't want that wire a little closer to the front so it's kind of in the thorax area. Jump my thread forward. Put a few cross wraps in. And we'll work with this back. And this feather comes from a hen ring neck pheasant. Um, kind of center back just below the shoulders. I just want to get an even amount off of each side. I want to tie the stem in with two relatively loose turns. Collect everything, pinch pull, and drag this forward until I get the distance that I want. That's pretty good. Work this forward on top. Trim that out. I'll go ahead and make another clean cut so I've got that little tip cut off. We'll go back to using this in just a minute. Next, we need well, I had some right here, I thought. A small gold oval tinsel or um, Gold wire would work. This flies very similar to a hare's ear. Okay, get this out the way. The dubbing is hare's mask. Uh, kind of in the oh medium color of the hair's mask. It's not super light. It's definitely not super dark. And somebody asked me to tie them this pattern and I said sure. So I just figured I'd shoot a video on it. And a little more. The whole body is the same, but I want to work this up into the thorax a little bit just to make sure I've got enough space for my rib to come up fully and completely with uh, four to six turns. All right. Catch. I'm going to work this back into the thorax just a little bit. pretty good. For the wing case, I've just got, um, it's just a goose feather that I found down at the park and cleaned up so we don't need anything fancy here. You're looking for three to three to four fibers. I'm 
We're going to trim out the tip on that. Just We want to get into the meat of it. Okay. Little wax goes a long way working with things like hair's mask. Really help. And I'm going to fold this wing case over. Okay. I'll do the legs in two parts using this V-cut. Again, I'll grab about a half dozen fibers or so. Try to get them lined out so that they're somewhat even. Be a challenge on some of these birds. They don't. One side of the barbs is a little bit longer than the other off each feather. So I'm just going to line this up. And then I'm going to take my fingers and try to sprawl this open a little bit to cover the underneath. Fold that back over the top of the eye. A few wraps. We'll do the same thing again. This time I'm going to aim a little higher up onto the sides. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Nope, shifted on me. Let's fold this back over. Trim out this hair. I'm just going to clean up the head just a little bit. And then to finish it off, we'll just give it a little wet whip. <clears throat> Work this back. And that's all there is to it. Simple little March Brown. Doesn't require a ton of material. Uh, if you liked the video, always appreciate a thumbs up, like, subscribe, and share. And as always, everybody, happy tying. Take care, and we'll see you next time.